Hello and welcome back to a new episode of Wildlifepedia. Today let's know some facts about cheetah. Cheetah also known as the world's fastest land animal. At top speeds of about 110 km per hour, or 68 miles per hour the cheetah takes three strides a second, covering nearly 7 meters per stride, that means 21 meters per second, that's really fast, but they cannot run at that speed for more than a minute, as they get quickly exhausted. They can't roar like tigers or lions because they lack two bones in their throat that allows other big cats to roar. But they do produce other sounds like growling, hissing, or chirping, and purring. Cheetah name is derived from Hindi language, meaning, cheetah, which means, the spotted one. The patterns on a cheetah are different from each other, which helps them to camouflage when hunting. There are some rare cases, where the cheetah's patterns blurs into stripes. These cats are called as king cheetahs. Cheetahs mainly hunt in the daytime unlike other big cats. Their eyesight is better than humans, it is believed that the black tear-like marks help them to reflect the glare of the sunlight. They can run from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 3 seconds. Their claws work like studs on spike shoes for extra grip while sprinting, and their long tail acts as a rudder, which help them take sharp turns while chasing their prey. Cheetahs need a lot of space to survive in the wild. They may roam a vast range of about 600 square miles or 1,000 square kilometers. They prefer to avoid competition with bigger predators. These cats have lost their habitat because of human encroachment and hunting. With people and cheetahs coming into closer contact, human-wildlife conflicts are also increasing. Female cheetahs raise and protect their cubs alone, and they teach their cubs how to hunt, and male cheetahs team up with their brothers or other males to form a coalitions or a group that defend their territory and team up for hunting. 80% of cheetahs have disappeared since 1900s. Cheetahs feed on small to medium-sized animals such as gazelles, hares, wildebeest, deers, antelopes, warthogs, birds, and zebras. They prefer open grasslands to survive, they live in habitats across eastern and southern Africa. They were earlier found throughout Asia and Africa, but today they are going towards extinction. Loss of habitat, hunting for their body parts, and declining numbers of their prey are the major reasons. Female cheetah usually give birth to three to five cubs. Cheetah's cubs are blind at birth, within ten days they open their eyes and they can see. Cubs reach half their adult size when they are six months old and mother cheetah teach their cubs how to hunt at this age. Cubs leave their mothers when they are one and a half years old. Cheetahs do not hunt daily, and usually hunt once in two to four days. After a cheetah catches its prey, they will bring it to a shaded hiding place so that other animals don't take it from them. Cheetahs will give up their prey when a stronger or larger predator approaches them to snatch their prey. They can live in the wild for 7 to 10 years, but they can live up to 16 years in captivity, because they don't have to face other predators and don't have to risk their life while hunting. Their eyesight is too good, they can see up to 3 miles in details, but they lack special night vision unlike most other cats. They can survive up to 10 days without water. They only drink water once every 2-4 to four days. They sleep 12 hours a day. Their claws are different from the other big cats and are only semi-retractable which gives them grip while running and chasing their prey, that's why they cannot climb trees like leopards. There are evidence of cheetahs living with humans since 3000 BC. During the period of Egypt, Cheetahs were a symbol of royalty and considered as Mofdet, the cat goddess. Cheetahs were kept as pets by many famous kings and emperors like Genghis Khan, Charlemagne, and Akbar. These cats were trained and used for sports and even hunting. Cheetahs were captured from the wild and kept in captivity and trained during the 14th to 16th century. 
In 1900s nearly 100,000 cheetahs were considered to be living in habitats throughout African continent, the Middle East and the Arabian Peninsula to India. Cheetahs have been extinct from large portions where they roamed. In Asia they are nearly extinct, with the largest confirmed population inhabiting these cats are in northeastern Iran but only with a few dozens. In Africa there are an estimated 8,000 to 11,000 cheetahs left, with the largest populations existing in Namibia, Zimbabwe in southern Africa and Tanzania in East Africa. Some exist in other countries, like the Central African Republic. All of their populations are threatened, even in protected areas, because of decreasing food source and fight for survival among large predators such as lions and hyenas. Outside of reserves and protected areas, humans are threat to them, because of habitat loss, they roam into human habitats, even poaching and killing them to protect livestock are the major reasons. Now let's see about the five subspecies of cheetahs. First comes the Sudan cheetah. The Sudan cheetah is also known as the Somali cheetah, Northeast African cheetah or Central African cheetah, and its scientific name is Asinonyx jubatus somaringii. They live in the savannas, grasslands and desert areas of Central and Northeast Africa. They are nearly extinct in Sudan. They closely resemble to the Tanzanian cheetah in looks. The dark spots of these cheetahs are widespread and separated, but there are no spots on their hind legs. Second is the Northwest African cheetah. The Northwest African cheetah, also known as the Senegal cheetah or Saharan cheetah, their scientific name is Asinonyx jubatus hecki, they are native of Northwest Africa. These cheetahs' appearance is quite distinct from other subspecies. Their coat is shorter and paler than other subspecies, and the tear-like stripes are sometimes faded or absent in some individuals. They are one of the most threatened among other cheetah subspecies, and are critically endangered. There are only about 250 mature individuals surviving in the wild. Next comes the Asiatic cheetah, or the Iranian cheetah, scientific name, Asinonyx jubatus venaticus. They are the rarest of all cheetah subspecies, and they are only found in Iran. These cheetahs were widely spread across the Arabian Peninsula and all the way across to India. They are also classified as critically endangered subspecies of cheetahs by IUCN. They are now found only in protected areas of Iran. The fourth subspecies is the Tanzanian cheetah, also known as the East African cheetah or Kenyan cheetah. The scientific name is Asinonyx jubatus rainy, they are native to East Africa. These subspecies inhabits the savannas and grasslands of Tanzania, Somalia, Kenya and Uganda. But these animals have gone regionally extinct in Rwanda and Burundi. The coat color differs from white yellowish in shade. These cheetahs are the second largest in population after the South African subspecies. Lastly the South African cheetah, also called the Namibian cheetah, its scientific name is Asinonyx jubatus jubatus. These are the most populated cheetahs among other subspecies. These cheetahs can be found in the savannas of the Okavango Delta, grasslands of the Transvaal, farmlands of Namibia, and the arid areas of the Kalahari. Even though they the highest populated among other subspecies, they face threat from human activities such as land encroachment and even been killed by poachers for their fur and other body parts. These cheetahs have gone extinct in Lesotho and Malawi. The South African cheetah have a golden or bright yellow coat, and a white underside. The dark spots on these cheetahs are much more dense than other subspecies. That's all in this episode of cheetahs and their subspecies. Thank you for watching this video. For more interesting facts about wild animals and wildlife, please like, comment, share and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.